super super mega excited to be sharing this video with you guys because today we're gonna be talking about the movie called ambrosia this is actually a drama film released in 2012 it's actually a canadian film that i would definitely recommend you guys to go watch if you haven't watched it yet i know you know it was released in 2012 but i still wanted to do a review regarding it because i found out that the storyline behind it's actually very very interesting and i really enjoyed watching the movie because it actually has a very different outcome than what i have expected so today we're gonna be talking about you know the relationship that developed between sarah and Layla on the movie and what and everything that happened between them but before we get into this video please let me know down below in the comments if any of you have watched this film and what are your thoughts on it do you like it do you dislike it and would you recommend people to go watch it i will definitely recommend you know anyone to go watch it it's quite a simple movie but it's still very very interesting so let's not waste any more time and let's get right into the topic so the movie is about the iranian canadian couple ali and leila who struggles to get you know their finances together so they go through a lot of ups and downs also finding out the way to fix their marriage and to see if their marriage is really worth the fighting for leila is a doubtful and very busy woman she's you know she's married you know her husband has a pizzeria and she also works as a waitress and she's also a fashion student her dream is to become a fashion designer sarah is a businesswoman and she's in the fashion industry she's a very very well-known person she is a teacher at a fashion school where you know leila studies fashion and she's also owns a fashion firm and she's married to a woman who is named monica sarah oh you know as time when, when goes by, uh, Sarah actually offers Leila a job at her fashion firm. Leila was super happy because that was her dream job, especially, you know, having to work two jobs and now she get this big opportunity. She was so, so happy. As time progresses, Leila begins to find herself in an unusual predicament. And why do I say that? Because her lesbian boss is hitting on her repeatedly and it's uncomfortable to say and things are getting very, very awkward because Leila can say yes but she can also not say no because it's very very weird that your boss is hitting on you knowing that your boss works with her girlfriend slash wife so it makes things very very awkward Sarah on the other hand is also having problems with her wife in this case Monica they also been dealing with you know relationship problems and they're not currently on the right terms Leila and her husband is going through a difficult economical crisis because uh, 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 Leila's husband actually just put their house on sale and he sold their house and you know because he doesn't want to give up on his business so he have decided to sell the house as time goes by Leila leaves her house uh, her husband actually and finds out she is pregnant she ends up keeping up the baby she, she wasn't you know planning on keeping the baby but she have decided to keep the baby but at this point she didn't tell her husband yet that she was married because she just lost her job her boss is hitting on her things are not going well you know and it's a lot to deal with so she just needed her time to get herself together Sarah keeps hitting on Layla and Layla is like trying to avoid her and Sarah also keeps telling Layla that Layla is not accepting her feelings because she is a woman because if she was a man you know Layla would have already said yes to all of this hitting on and Sarah was Sarah was very, very persistent knowing that, you know, her wife works at the same firm as her. They work together. They are partners, you know, and you're hitting on a new employee that you have decided to hire. It's like, come on, like she was doing too much. She was pressing too hard, you know. Leila keeps avoiding Sarah, but Sarah keeps pursuing her and things were starting to get very, very uncomfortable and awkward. Leila started to develop a friendship with Monica and Monica really cared for Sarah as a co-worker and friend as well because they started to get very very close but at this point you know uh, Sarah didn't know that Leila and Monica they were getting close to one another because uh, Monica and Leila kept their friendship very very low key you know they had good conversation you know uh, uh, Leila even helped Monica design the dress for Sarah so it was something very very good to see because at the beginning of the film I thought that Monica was like the bad guy but in this case the bad guy was actually Sarah for playing 
Monica like that, knowing that Monica is trying to fix their relationship. Monica starts having her suspicion that Sarah is hitting on Layla and she starts to put, you know, two and two together. And, you know, she found out that her suspicions was right, that Sarah was definitely, definitely pursuing Layla behind her back. And she was heartbroken when she found out. Monica was trying to fix her relationship, but everything she was trying to do, Sarah was just not having it. So, you know, and now that she finds out about, you know, Sarah pursuing Layla, you know, it just made things not get any better. Layla rejects Sarah and puts her end of the awkwardness and tells her that she's not interested and basically she don't want to have anything with her that she wants to fix her relationship with her husband but Sarah was still in denial but Layla kept it real 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 with her and so like regardless of anything I'm really you know grateful for the opportunity you have given me but I'm not interested in you and like you need to basically stop you have a wife who works with us you gotta stop and that's when you know Monica caught them in action and I feel like it all and if you actually see Layla's facial expression you can actually see that she was happy that Monica finally discovered who Sarah is and that Sarah is playing games behind her back. Layla at the end of the movie she reconnects with her husband she finally have the conversation with him and she tells him that you know she is pregnant and they're basically gonna be parents uh, so there was something also good to see because her husband is not a bad person they've been together for 14 years you know their relationship go through ups and downs and I'm also happy to see that Sarah finally got what she deserved Monica called her Monica finally sees Sarah for who she is and who she you know for who she is and not for who she wants her to to be and I feel like uh, Sarah and Monica they broke up and I really hope that Monica you know did break up with Sarah because Sarah definitely definitely doesn't deserve her so basically yes Layla and her husband Ali they have a happy ending Sarah and Monica breaks up to as is what it looks like so yes guys this is not like a lesbian lesbian movie but it definitely has a lesbian couple and a lesbian possible affair that happened during the movie but I'm really really happy that you know uh, Layla didn't fall into Sarah's you know temptations because one of the reason is because Sarah is very very bossy like she doesn't take no for an for an answer and when she has her eye on something she just goes for it she doesn't care who gets in her way and who she hurts in the process of getting there and the fact that you know Layla actually stood up to her and told her hey I'm not interested you gotta stop you have a beautiful woman next to you so why are you doing all of this is very very unnecessary it was something very good and very positive to see so yes guys like i said in the beginning of the video the movie is very very straightforward it's very self-explanatory you know it's very simple so yes that's basically it. please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to the channel and thank you thank you so much for all the love and all the support and if you guys have watched this movie please let me know down below in the comments what are your thoughts on it from 1 to 10 i would definitely rate this movie a 6 6.5 I just felt like uh, I wanted to see more of Monica. I wanted to see more why Monica and Sarah's relationship have when you know was going through. I Monica and Sarah's relationship was going through for them to get to this point. But yes, guys, that's basically it. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Until the next video, and goodbye.